Willkommen zurück zu einer weiteren Folge Sherlock Holmes und es geht direkt weiter. Denn ich feiere das Game. Kleiner Junge. Is someone there? I'm gonna collar him. I'll be right behind you. Police! I'll get right there. What the fuck, so looks a kleiner Junge. All right, my fine fellow. Who are you, and what are you doing here? Your detectives are. <laughs> You imagine that I'm connected with the death of Captain Carey. I assure you I'm innocent. Innocent? And what are you doing in his cabin? Shall I tell you? You came to retrieve what you had lost after killing Peter Carey. But we were here, waiting for you. What is your name? John Hopley Nelligan, but I... I didn't... Do you deny that you came here yesterday? No, but... but I... yes, it, it's just that I couldn't... I'm tired of this. Off we go to the yard. Tomorrow, I'll see that you're put in front of the judge. What? But you can't! I'm not... It's a terrible mistake! Enough! You can explain all of that to the judge. You're coming with me to the yard. But... In light of recent events, it seems evident that your coming here was unnecessary. All the same, I'm very grateful to you, Mr. Holmes. You are welcome, Inspector. But please don't be too hard on our young fellow. I would like to question him tomorrow morning. Okay. Scotland Yard. Ich komme hier überall rein. Cool. These are the suspects' belongings. Ring? And Park, 1883. From R. Dawson to my friend Dawson. I've seen this name before. Perhaps my archive holds the answer. A handkerchief with the initials J. H. N. The notebook that we found on Peter Carey's cabin floor. These abbreviations mean something. A pocket knife. It was used to force the door of Peter Carey's... <coughs> Lock. Schade. Boah, die Tür ist aber laut. Geht zu, Tür. Was zum... Okay. 
Okay. Does this notebook belong to you? Yes. But where did you find it? I did not know... I, I, I thought I'd lost it at the hotel. What do these abbreviations mean? Oh, no. I beg you, I can't. If I told you, it would only make things worse. But I will find out eventually, Mr. Nelligan. Okay. Fehlt irgendwo noch was. The sea knife was found near Carrie's body. Tell me, Mr. Nelligan, did Mr. Carrie try to defend himself or to attack you with it? I don't know. I didn't kill anyone. The police seized this valuable ring from you. Whose is it? I didn't steal it from anyone. It has always belonged to me. The police seized this valuable ring from you. Whose is it? I didn't steal it from anyone. It has always belonged to me. The ring's date of engraving is many years ago. You would have been a child then, hardly in any position to receive such an item from a partner. So, Mr. Nelligan, who is the true owner of the ring? The ring is mine. Scheiße. So, Mr. Nelligan, who is the true owner of the ring? The ring is mine. Best. So, Mr. Nelligan, who is the true owner of the ring? The ring is mine. Ah. No, Mr. Nelligan. I believe that the ring had belonged to your father. Oh, but, but, but how do you know? The jacket you are wearing is made of an expensive fabric that only a man of exceptional wealth could afford. You do not seem to me to be a rich man, Mr. Nelligan. Furthermore, the garment is ill-fitting. It is quite clear that it belonged to someone else, most probably your father. With your father gone and taking with him the family's wealth, as a little boy you had to find yourself a manual job, and it was most probably fish cleaning puts, fish. Yeah. You cut your hands often while working. Ah, okay. I can tell from the scars. I'm speechless, Mr. Holmes. It, it all happened exactly as you say. Well, 
I will see you soon, young man. Please, let me go. I'm innocent. John Nelling scheint ein gewöhnlicher Einbrecher zu sein. Welche Rolle spielt er in diesem Fall? Gute Frage. These are the suspect's belongings. These abbreviations mean something. But what? Das habe ich doch jetzt alles gemacht. stage a reconstruction. I'm sure that Watson would be happy to oblige. Dr. Watson hat Ihnen allzu gerne bei den Vorbereitungen zu einer Harpoon-Experiment zur Hand gehen. Ja gut! Watson, wo bist du? Ja, Watson. Nee. Muss ich den jetzt erst bei mir daheim mal abholen? Spot of whaling, Watson. Would you care to take part? Are you serious? No, but we do need to clarify what happened on the night of Black Peter's murder. A reenactment, then? Is something bothering you? The sailor's knife, Watson. Why was it on the floor? Peter Carey attempted to defend himself? It is possible, but if that is the case, then it alters many things. I don't quite follow you. Tell me, my friend, what is the animal closest to man, morphologically, I mean? 
Ah, I see what you're getting at, Holmes. You asked me that once before, on the Ripper case, I believe. Do you want to slit some more pig's throats? No. Thank goodness for that. I wish to impale one with a harpoon. Wonderful. <laughs> Watson, let us pay a visit to our butcher friend in Whitechapel. We require the carcass of a well-fed pig. And the harpoon? One of the harpoons on the wall of Black Peter's cabin should do quite nicely. Hey, that is hoops. I need to take a harpoon with me. Ach so, also dahin wieder. Ja. So, aber wie es weitergeht, erfahren wir in der nächsten Folge. Bis dann, bleibt gespannt. Genießt den Tag. Bye, bye.